And if the media is here, I hope you pay attention. Would you please tell these people how Marquette High School tried to sh shackle you? And has this ever happened to you anywhere else? Well, shackle is kind of a strong word. I, I was invited to speak at the high school, and then when they told me I couldn't speak about the mine, I refused to speak at the high school. just really sad that the students weren't able, of course I would give a different speech there than I did here, but, but the, stu the students weren't able to learn how to um, play in our democracy and that, that part was very sad. Um, hopefully the school will come around, but this is a company town, even though the company isn't really sort of all the way here yet, it is a company town and you have to understand that and um, there was one brave, her heroic, courageous teacher who put up a good struggle to try and get me there, and, and unfortunately it didn't happen. Has this ever happened to you? It actually has happened to me a lot. Um, people, are, people are afraid of me um, as it relates to, as it relates to, I, I'm opposed to things that people are opposed to, I, um, and then they made other people outside fearful of speaking. So, so that's how they control us, and that's what we have to overcome. But by now, uh, most of the community knows who we are. Do you know the identity of whoever instructed you not to mention the line at the high school? I do not know who it, who who was in charge of saying I shouldn't talk about the mine at the high school. I, d I don't know that. It is interesting. And you know what it does is it puts the children in the middle. So if I did go and talk and one of the children asked me a question about the mind, how was I to answer that question? I'm sorry, I'm not allowed to speak. And then it's like the grown-ups are having a fight. You know, I don't think that's helpful to the students. And, and that was why. It wasn't, it wasn't because I was being obstinate or you know, egocentric. It was like, well, I have children too, and I don't want my children put in that position. School is school, and you should respect people's decisions in school. And, I just want to be clear, other schools have asked you to do this? Um, other schools have, have um, not allowed me to speak, yes. Because the, the local group arranged it, where the teachers arranged it, and then somehow, um, waste management is one of my favorite groups that are in every school, most schools. They have lots of their propaganda there. And when they hear I'm coming, it's like they convince people that I have a radical um, speech or, you know, I, I don't know, what the, I'm not privy to the conversation, so I don't know what they say. But yeah, it's happened in other schools. This is not unique. And that's what I keep telling you. Nothing that's happening here is unique and different than anywhere else. It's unique to you and maybe appalling to you, but it is, it, your community is similar to other communities who have won, by the way. You have a chance to win here. I mean, actually, you have a better chance than some other communities because you're not as far along with this mind as some other communities especially the ones out west. The students weren't able to learn how to um, play in our democracy, and that, that part was very sad, very sad, very sad, very sad.